Hello and welcome to a brief overview of BMC's TrueSight IT Data Analytics trial. This video will help answer some common questions about the process to download, install, and try the software. I'll also walk you through some architecture and hardware requirements so you can prepare your environment for the installation. By now you should have a relative understanding about what IT data analytics can do for you, and you might have some ideas about how you want to test it out during the trial. Don't worry, it's easy. It'll take about 30 minutes once you get started, and I'll also provide you some examples to get you going. Let's start by taking a closer look at the architecture. For this trial, you can put everything you need on one server. We recommend this. The architecture is scalable and can be split apart to accommodate large volumes of data, but for this trial, let's keep it simple. You may install the software on either Windows or Linux. Both installation packages are available in the trial download and can be delivered to you on physical media if you request it. When loading the software onto a single server, we recommend that you allocate two CPU cores, four gigabytes of RAM, and enough disk space to handle 10 gigabytes of data a day. So for a 30-day trial, you may need up to about 300 gigabytes of disk space. Remember that the trial license will expire 30 days from when you execute the software installation. The web console, configuration database, and search engine make up one component. The search engine is an item that can be separated out into scaled servers to allow for simultaneous searching. The indexing component can also be scaled out to do parallel operations across multiple servers. And finally, the collection station can have multiple servers to add disparate collection points throughout the infrastructure. The collection stations access data either through an agent or agentlessly, and the console allows you to export the data with other integrations or other analytics components. We purposely built IT data analytics on a very modular, extensible platform. That means scalability and quick time to value for you. Well, let's look at some of the ports that we'll be using for planning purposes. The main reason we recommend putting everything on a single server is to avoid conflicts with other ports or having to deal with firewall issues. So it makes it easier for you. The details of the actual port assignments are in the documentation. But the main port that we're concerned with for the installation is port 9797. This is the main port that we'll be accessing the console GUI with. Some hints on browsers, we've also extensively tested Firefox 27 and above, IE 9 and above, and Google Chrome 33 and above. So where do we start? Well, first you'll follow the link and sign up for the trial. You'll receive an acceptance email with instructions on how to download the code. You'll then allocate the appropriate resources, much of which you probably have already done. Next, you'll download the code and follow the installation instructions in the next video. After that, you can log on and then start testing using either the examples that we provide or your own examples that you want to test with. Then you get some time to explore the product and then provide us feedback. So I encourage you to check out the next couple of videos on how to install and also how to continue testing the product. Well, thank you very much for taking some time to understand a little bit more about the installation process for BMC's IT Data Analytics.